everyone. Robin from Backscatter here at the 2017 Digital Shootout on beautiful Bon Air. Today we're taking a look at the brand new Panasonic GH5 Micro Four Thirds mirrorless camera. We've got underwater housings for the GH5 from both Nauticam and Subal, and they've been in the water all day, every day, because this is one of the most popular camera systems on offer this year. Both of these housings offer full control support and a host of accessories, meaning you've got a fully capable underwater rig with the GH5. The GH5 is the successor to the GH4, and it's pretty much improved in every single way. Now, the standout feature of the GH5 is the ability to shoot 4K 60p video. This is the only camera that's capable of shooting 4K 60p besides the Canon 1DX Mark II, and the GH5 is just a fraction of the price. That 60p frame rate means you can slow down your playback to 30p, doubling the length of your clip and really helping to eliminate any camera wobbles. When you combine that with the 5-axis in-body image stabilization, that means your video footage is going to be incredibly stable. You can also play back your footage at 4K 60 frames per second on a 4K TV, giving you hyper-real, incredibly lifelike video playback. In addition to that, it'll also shoot 1080, 180p video, meaning you can slow down your HD footage up to seven and a half times, making some really, really cool slow motion work. On top of all that, we're super excited because the GH5 captures an accurate manual white balance at depth. This is one thing that most cameras really struggle with. There's also a ton of mirrorless cameras on the market right now, but so far, the GH5 is clearly the leader of the pack when it comes to capturing that accurate underwater white balance. Executing a white balance on the GH5 is one of the simplest we've seen out of almost any mirrorless or compact camera. It only takes about three button presses and you're ready to rock. It also has four custom white balance banks, meaning you can store up to four white balances for shooting at different depths or with or without video lights. One huge thing to keep in mind is that if your camera can't capture an underwater white balance accurately, none of the other shooting specs really matter because for underwater video, color is everything. In addition to these video capabilities, it'll also capture a tack sharp 20 megapixel still at 12 frames per second making it a blazing fast still shooter. The new image sensor inside means that you're gonna get sharper and lower noise images than ever before. This camera autofocuses incredibly fast and very accurately. So if you're using that back button autofocus technique like we prefer for underwater shooting, that means your shots are gonna be tack sharp every time. In addition to that, especially when shooting in manual focus mode, you can take advantage of the focus peaking feature. This is going to display a red outline around the critical focus point of your subject right here on the LCD screen, so you don't have to rely on just your eyes to determine that critical focus point. This is essential when shooting macro, because that means you're going to nail that focus point with every shot. There's six custom function buttons on this camera, and most underwater housings are going to access most of those, meaning you can really tailor this thing to your shooting needs. You can equip it with a variety of Micro Four Thirds lenses from both Panasonic and Olympus. You've got everything from an 8mm fisheye lens, rectilinear zoom lenses, 60mm macro lenses, and just about everything in between. There's a whole bunch more video specs that we could talk about with this, but we really don't have time at the moment. The bottom line is that if the GH5 doesn't meet your underwater video needs, you're probably going to start looking at something like a cinema rig, such as a RED or an ARRI. At this point, I think it's very safe to say that we're calling the GH5 the camera of the year. You're not going to find anything out there right now that's more versatile, portable, and affordable when compared to its peers with similar shooting specs. I'm Robin from Backscatter signing off. Be sure to stay tuned for more awesome underwater content from the GH5 and a whole bunch of other underwater systems from Backscatter here at the Digital Shootout.